A Katyusha rocket fired by Palestinian terrorists in northern Gaza fell in North Ashkelon on Thursday morning, not far from a hotel. It is the northernmost spot a Katyusha rocket fired from Gaza has landed. In October, one exploded in fields near Nitivot. Today, the terrorists in Gaza launched a rocket targeting the city of Ashkelon, the home to 120,000 people. This is an escalation. This is them extending their range, and this, of course, can't go on. Every government must defend its citizens, and we are obligated to defend our people. The terrorists are deliberately shooting rockets into population centers, trying to kill as many innocent people as they can, and we must stop them. Shortly after the Katyusha attack, the Air Force launched a series of airstrikes in Gaza targeting separate sites. Palestinians reported at least 10 were wounded. Earlier in violent clashes between IDF forces and armed Palestinians in Khan Yunus, at least five armed Palestinians were killed in a series of strikes launched by the army on the ground and in the air. In Nablus, intense clashes erupted between stone-throwing Palestinians and Israeli security forces who have been operating in the city since early morning. Palestinians reported 10 wounded, including a three-year-old infant. On Tuesday, Defense Minister Barak met with soldiers of the Golani Brigade who are currently operating in the city. <laughs> יהיו המקרים החריגים, ושאת רוב המחבלים אנחנו נירט בתוך הקסבות לפני שהם מנסים לבצע פיגוע. פה התבצעת הלחימה האמיתית בטרור, הרמטכ"ל מוביל עשייה מבצעית רצופה גם בעזה ו... ובצפון וגם פה. וקורית פה פעילות מבצעית חשובה מאוד וטובה מאוד, שמכוחה אפשר לחיות חיים נורמליים בשבילת החוף.